in Night Jester. I was thinking more about uh, um, the topic of uh, that uh, that goal, that excitement, um, that, uh, that that kind of seizing the life uh, thing that just that occurs. Um, and I remember at one point in time in my life, and I wrote this down actually. And at the time, it sticks in my mind even more deeply because. When I wrote it down, this uh, this idea, this plan, um, someone at the very moment, uh, someone actually that I cared a lot about, asked me what I was writing, and I said, "Oh, it's, it's kind of kind of like a a life goal, or like, or at least like a goal at the moment um, to help me find something." And uh, they said, "What'd you write?" And I said, uh, "Um." Look, look for, look for ways to reclaim innocent joy, and uh, they they burst out laughing. <laughs> they were laughing at me, um, and uh, when they were done having their hoot and holler, um, they asked me what my plan was, and I'm like, I don't know. I'm just going to start now. I mean, that's the heading. Now I'm going to start brainstorming um, ideas. And I remember uh, one of the things that I never pursued, I wrote down underneath that uh, uh, bubble machine. That's all I wrote. You know, how awesome is a bubble machine? Just keep it on the back porch every once in a while. Fill it up. When it's windy, plug it in. And just have bubbles go flying off your back porch. There's no reason for it. It just is. It's just fun. Um, Okay, but one of the things I wrote down was... uh, roller skating. As a child, I liked to roller skate. And so I thought, oh, I'm going to go. I'm going to get me some roller skates. And like, I hadn't roller skated in a million years. And when I tried them on in the store, I got, uh, actually I'd done some research and uh, I knew these really great pair of adult skates that a lot of people that were doing uh, on YouTube, they are doing fancy tricks and stuff, were wearing these skates. So I went and bought those. And I put them in the store, and I guess the person just naturally assumed if I was going to drop that much money on roller skates, I must be a roller skater. So I put them on, and it promptly just fell down right there on their floor. And they were uh, they were this close to being angry at me about it. Um, but I put them on and uh, just practiced and took to roller skating, and uh, what a joy, what a joy it was. And uh, I think that based on that success, I was going to start looking into my past because sometimes you follow uh, paths of enjoyment and you get to a point where you stop. Like I was thinking, I stopped uh, doing yoga um, about when my business stopped. And I realized that I shouldn't have let uh, that cease then. What I should have done is uh, uh, got in touch with it again. I'd gone back and taken classes rather than, you know, like it wasn't something that it should have ceased. It's something I should have tried to find a new way to explore. So, so yeah, I'm going to be thinking a little bit more about that and uh, uh, searching for ways to uh, regain those uh, innocent joys. All right, well, I just thought I'd add that to your video or our video. And, uh, yeah, I'll see you in the tubes.